let's do this. So hello there everybody, welcome back for another week of War Games Tutorial Thursday with your host, your favorite Finn here, man. This is the mostly weekly FAQ Q&A and news about the Industrial Marines development, yada yada yada. Unofficial, let me just adjust the, uh, some of the settings, there we go. I noticed that the uh, in-game audio has been quite loud compared to my own audio. And uh, I'll just wait for the elevator to get to the top before going anywhere with this uh, stuff. And, uh, okay, for a second I thought I was going to get blocked. <laughs> Squished it against the roof. So I'm in Canyon. There we go. And uh, there's the ambient sound. That likes to drown my <laughs> audio for a second. I was worried, like, oh, really? The game is that quiet, eh? Nope. So let's hope the audio is better this time. So let's uh, go for the news. Well, in, ter in terms of uh, the Star Wars development, there isn't really any, except I, if I recall correctly, the leaning is now available for testing in single player or something along those lines. Let's see if uh, we have uh, input. Uh, free camera. No, it doesn't seem like it's here, so I presume it's on the. Uh, whatchamacallit? Uh, ITO build or something along those lines. I could be wrong. Don't take. Because I could swear that the announcement message, which I should have read before saying anything of this out. But, uh, you know, I'm fairly sure it said something like it's available available for a test in the playground or single player or something along those lines. I'm not entirely sure. But something, something dark side like that. So there should be. There may or may not be something to test with the leaning. Yeah. Sorry if I'm out of energy and some, something along those lines. I'm somewhat tired and I'm sort of stressed. Like, uh, everything right now is stressing me out for whatever reason. So, yeah. The, the miniatures were a good diversion from it, but unfortunately I have now finally painted all of them. So, so much for that thing, idea. <laughs> and um yeah i'm hoping uh well i'm trying to get some uh pointers from my friends so i could get my uh, uh so the uh the iron warriors army itself is painted well what the mini all the miniatures that i have are now painted and uh, i have a new list for the kill team that includes some cultists and I don't have any cultists, but I had an idea that, you know, since I made the buildings for the Stella Marines, if I ever have, will have cultists... Oh, good lord. <laughs> if I ever will have any cultists, they will be um, in the Stella Marines. As a solo auxilia for the 30k games, whatever. So, my cultists would be the Marines from this game... And <laughs> so I'm looking into some 3D printing stuff so I could get me a couple of marines for that kill team for starters and paint those things and see how they turn out. Most of them right now are going to be melee with a couple of them holding some heavy stubbers, which I suppose will be ARs for now. <laughs> the rest of them will be holding a knife and a pistol or something along those lines. Because, uh, well, then again, there is no pistol, but I'm sure it wouldn't be too hard to get a pistol, just random ass pistol model out of somewhere. I would use bolt pistols, but there isn't any extra on the boxes that I have. And I don't have ex any extra, extra bolt guns that I could cut up into a pistol either. So, uh, I guess I will just search for a random 3D model of a pistol somewhere. 
and scale it down for the humans to use because yeah aside from the guys that will be holding the heavy weapons uh they are supposed to have brutal melee weapon or something like the slides but i don't know it would it wouldn't look nice to have like <laughs> having a club with nails on it doesn't really fit the Interstellar Marines aesthetic. So they're just gonna have a knife and a pistol. And that's supposedly the brutal <laughs> weapon. I think I had like four of them. No, hold on. I can't remember. Three or four melee guys. Two guys with AR. And uh, one with just regular automatic shot. Let's weak it down. Oh, and there is his friend. Slow reactions, because I want them points. But yeah, something, something dark side, yada, yada, yada. That's more or less what I have in mind. So hopefully, I can get those few guys up and running and possibly paint them. Would look cool. Our manga just died. I can't tell whatever I been noticed or someone else. Seems like someone else. Ah, for fuck's sake. <laughs> hmm. 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 And he had a green shoulder pad and something like that. So that's what I think I will do for a medic. Oh god, I'm dead. And uh, I will definitely use the urban construction or whatever, the one with the hazard stripes because, you know, Iron Warriors. And. Uh, I think I will make someone have <laughs> my winter camo, although I don't I don't have any greens. I guess I could use the liquid green stuff, but yeah. Overall, I'm not sure what the quote-unquote main color would be, like the standard. Okay. That's fine. That's power manga.
Oh, for crying out loud, this is definitely not <laughs> helping out my stress at all. Like, ugh. Good, we got some platforms over here. Incidentally, nobody has gone down the shaft yet, which is <laughs> weird, but whatevs. Ah, oh, because some someone figured out to, you know, restart all the switches for whatever reason. Don't think it's just two of them. It is three of them. <laughs> and the random guy shows up once again. Increasing the audio. Yes, apparently people can sneak up on me just fine. Hello. Subarctic. Here we go. Almost on the other side of the map.
terrible choice of the route. Wow, there's still plenty of points in ops, but uh, uh, way too much stress in that place for me right now. Just gonna try to chill and kill. Although this giant ass wind blowing into my ears isn't exactly. Yeah, I think that's uh, something that this game really is lacking. Like, everything is very stressful. It doesn't feel like there is really that much of a. What do you call it? Calming, so to say. Don't know how to else describe it. And now we play Spot the Bush. There, no one there. There's like a dark around shadow around that section. And same go for that bush. And Sway taking the shot at it. Can't really hear anyone, but if they are around here and they be hearing these shots, I don't expect them to be moving around much. Like that guy. Okay. Giggles. Taking three shots. Hmm. Interesting. Guess I always shot his head. Now, the question is where is Power Manga? Fuck it. YOLO There we go Now waiting for the next announcement <laughs> That's the wrong kind. Like, uh, speaking of the whole wind and all that jazz in here, like, none of the trees are, they are all static, so it can't be this windy here, like, <laughs> it doesn't really add up. Ooh, canyon is there. And the points already got picked up. I would be... Eh, might as well head there. Alert. Weapons. Drop rate. ET Wetlands is... On the complete opposite side of the map. So, fuck it. Who knows, maybe they will come through Canyon and all that jazz. A CTR. <laughs> okay. Well, <sighs> lucky me. <coughs> No, right next to the wetlands door, for whatever that's worth. Am I going the right way? More or less. I 
mountains, eh? God damn it. They say TR, so they're pissing me off. Yay. Well, so much for that bag. And before getting shot on my back by a camper, let's see, subarctic is right there. Uh, oh well. Also, the whole wind thing. It, we are surrounded by fucking rocks and. Ugh. Oh, everything. So, <laughs> there can't be this much. Uh, it's the wind. Yeah. Lost them points. There's one, three, two, three man. Uh, no. One, three man team and two. No. Two, three man teams and the solo player. Ugh. <laughs> <sighs> Let's see, woodlands, I'm nowhere near. On random note, I did up, uh, post a challenge to the, um, what do you call it, the, um, the volunteers a couple of weeks ago what it would take to make uh, some sort of rudimentary inventory system. Very oversimplified picture. And overall, overly simplifying a basic inventory. <laughs> basically, that's what the post was. And basically, to poke the eyes if anyone would be up for the challenge and let's just say they went too keen on that if you're interested to see what uh what i posted to them if you go to the the suggestions um channel in the discord and search for tns finn and well uh, actually your favorite finn with the uh just the image shirts you will find the images that i posted that basically i took a One of them pictures. Just took a picture from the. Um, what do you call it? The. Um, I don't even know. <laughs> Concept art pictures with the T Post Marine. And I just added some shit like boxes and weapons to show what it would look like and like the general idea of it. That uh, what you carry is uh, actually shown on your marine and you would have limited inventory space overall to do stuff anyway. But yeah, and some of the stuff you wouldn't be able to store like let's say your backpack you could store ammo and points in there but like if you had the ammo in the backpack you wouldn't be able to it wouldn't be part of the ammo pool so you would have to take it out and put it on the pouches on your belt 
to be able to use that ammo. And rather than directly picking up the points, the players would have like a USB stick kind of thing that contains all the points that they carry. And rather than instantly, you would be looting an actual bag. You wouldn't get all of the items like you do right now. You would actually open the inventory and drag and drop from there a dead corpse to on you, whatever you wish. And the points would be, or quote unquote, the intel would be on uh, like a stick that you would have to pick up and then find a safe location to unpack, download, or whatever. So, instead of having the points instantly, you still, like, have to find... <sighs> find a location to actually <laughs> download this stuff. Oh, I'm so annoyed. I should, to be honest... I shouldn't be playing when I'm stressed out like this, but fuck it. Uh, where did I die? Mountains. There we go. <laughs> he dropped the points in resort, which could be my next destination. Let's see, resort. They already picked up the points. But with some luck, they might be heading over this direction. <coughs> so I might run into them. Who knows? But yeah, the whole uh, inventory system would actually make... Uh, it's more tactical of actually, like, you'd want to shoot out the lights from the backpacks. And at the back, you can't tell when it's been looted or stuff like that. <laughs> you'd have to access it yourself, but that being said, it wouldn't really work on a sc It really wouldn't work on Skyrim since that would be backpacks everywhere. <sighs> the mountains is <laughs> skippy de boo de be de do. There should be a pad right around here. Go. You guys should have seen the face bomb I had with that failed jump attempt. Huh. Oh. Oh, hello there, sexy. Time to 
Time to go say them a hello. If, on if only I could shoot for the life of me. It's Rico, man. Only spend the entire back missing him. <coughs> now to see what are the occupants up to over this general direction. See, they sh still should have one if I remember correctly. Nope, it's just two of them. <laughs> and I presume they came from Luna. But might as well go check. No? Okay, that's interesting. See, that's the same ambience again. Well, it's a different one, but... Three-man team is probably just about now exiting the uh, docking bay. I take a guess. Well, for what I, I forgot the whole uh, during the news section for whatever it's worth. Kim has a full child now, <laughs> which uh, congrats to Kim. <laughs> so yeah, I suppose that's one news. Unfortunately, I haven't been able to get in touch with him. 
So the whole uh, not having too high hopes for that then diggity um, interior and all that jazz. Someone is probably watching over this box. But I'm a lazy bastard. Can't be asked to look every single corner and all that jazz. Jungle was the next one, if I remember correctly. Now the question is, how to, does one get there? That might be 250 points, but... Oh, that's way up, I think. Yeah, this should be doable jump, if only I can get on top of the rock. Time to locate some jungle. It is connected apparently to Luna, but I don't see a jungle door that I'm right next to. Yep. Herp <laughs> Like, again, listen to that, all that audio. I think it, there's just too much ambience, like, overall. Or rather, it should be quiet. If there's a gunfight, it should quiet down. Because jungle, like... Excuse me. Like, think about it. Jungle should be relatively quiet, right? That being quiet keeps you alive unless it's a freaking mating season or something along those lines. Oh, industrial, you say? Yeah, I don't know. I wouldn't know many jungles that would be full of uh, wildlife and tripping and all that jazz, especially when there's a, a you know, gunfight going on. Resort, eh?
There's a dead seat here with the... But the other one seemed just fine. Did someone pick up the bag or is it just out of my range? I think someone picked up the bag. Oh. There's a Rico man. He is not part of the team. Give it a shot, shall we? Got it. Next stop, resort. I have options. And I will choose Canyon. I guess Power Manga and the fellas are not gonna move anywhere with the um, the let's see twenty one some like twenty three thousand points. Yeah, they are more or less won the game unless I somehow pick off Fenris and hit Mac and Henry Mage a couple times. They don't really need to do much. Mountains, you say? His points were immediately picked up. Oh, he crashed. Uh, so, who knows? They might be heading the resort. I don't think so. Highly doubt it, but there's a good chance for some action. If not anything else, I can just uh, get him. Don't tell me I'm in the wrong side. I am. I am in the wrong side of light. Canyon is gonna be the final battleground from the looks of it. Running dangerously exhausted here, but so long as I so long as I don't get into a fight before hitting that door, I should be fine. Let's hope the points are still there. 
If not, well, I'll just have to. The points have been taken. And the mountain's door is over there. So they technically are on the opposite side of the map. With some luck, they might be heading towards that thing to grab some points. There's also a good chance they might be heading this way. Just sneaking about. <sighs> Trying to listen. Front you listen and listen well. But no, it doesn't seem like anyone's here. So Canyon will be the final battleground. Gotta get into positions in Canyon. Although, again, highly doubt that they would be here. Because, like I said, they will win just by doing nothing at all. not nice can't really get an angle on it to take it out The 
orientation is wrong. Everything's really wrong. Moonlight is kind of annoying. Well, uh, let's give it a shot, see how it goes. I got it, but yeah. No fighting. No fighting at all. Even before I get headshot by car 98. <laughs> like that. Pretty good prediction, even if I do say so myself. And with that comes to an end another week of War Games to Drill Thursday. Won't have enough time to get them unless they are running directly at me. Oh no, I'm in a complete wrong place. So they were still in the resort and <laughs> yeah. There you go. Hope you guys enjoyed this week's World Games to Real Thursday. I've been your host, your favorite fan, and hopefully until next week, guys. See ya.